Hi, King and Vista Mustangs. Welcome to our virtual CV Honors Ceremony. For all of the parents and families who are watching, welcome to our ceremony. For those who I may not have met before, my name is Nicole Haggerty and I am the very proud principal here at King and Vista Middle School. Of course, we would all hope that we would be having this ceremony at school in our cafeteria to give each of our students that moment to walk up on the stage and receive their recognition. But just as we're having to adjust and make other plans for lots of different events that we have going on at Canyon Vista in the spring semester, we are now holding a virtual CV Honors Ceremony. And I'm so glad that we have this opportunity to recognize our students. So typically, this is the point in the ceremony where I encourage parents to embarrass your middle school children and come right up to the stage and take pictures and whoop and holler. And you can do just that from your home in your living room or wherever you may be watching this with your student. So the way our virtual ceremony will work is each of our teachers who are recognizing a student will say a few words about your, their, their student that they chose, your child. And hopefully this will coincide and soon, either before you watch this video or soon after, you will receive your child certificate in the mail. So again, I just wanna express, um, I wish so badly that we could be on our stage and I could shake all of our students' hands and present them with their certificate. But in uh, amid our school closures, this is our virtual CV Honors Ceremony. I also wanna to mention to parents and students, just so you're aware of what a big honor this is. Our teachers teach anywhere from 120 up to some of our teachers even teach almost 180 students in the course of their day and the teachers are only able to choose one CV honor student per semester so two per year so I want you students to know the fact that you are chosen as one of only two CV honors recipients from your teacher for this whole school year it really is a big honor so congratulations to you all of our students well done, I'm very proud of you, miss you very much, and can't wait to see you again. Congratulations. Hey Mustangs, I just wanted to give you a quick shout out. I'm so proud of all of our eighth grade CV honor students. You guys are amazing and I'm just so proud of you. Wish I could be there to celebrate you. Bye. Hi Mustangs, Ms. Galvan here. Just wanna take a second to say congratulations to all of you who are being recognized by your teachers today um, with a CV Honor um, Award, I love that. And uh, just, I'm so proud of you um, and that your teachers have recognized some amazing qualities in, in you. Um, I also just wanna say, um, we really miss y'all and really hate that this year turned out the way that it did. Um, but we know you guys are hard workers and you are gonna do amazing things in high school and beyond, far beyond. So please stay in touch with us. We really wanna know how you're doing um, and hopefully we'll get to see each other in the not too distant future. Bye guys. Hi, I'm Danae Schwab. I teach eighth grade US history. I have chosen this month for our CV honors to be Barry. I am so grateful for all his hard work. He is such a great student and gives a lot of effort on everything he does. He always asks such great questions and is always contributing to the class. Barry, I hope all is well, and congratulations on CV Honors. Hi, Karen. Um, I miss you, and I'm so excited that you are my 8th grade CV Honor student. Uh, you did a fantastic job on your book staff this year, motivating other students, getting them to complete their work, and also taking on any jobs that I asked you to take on. So I appreciate you, and um, I hope you're doing great. Thanks. Hey Katie, congratulations on being chosen for CV Honors. I'm so happy I was able to pick you for this. I think you really deserve it. I loved having you in class this year and I know I'm gonna miss seeing you around Canyon Vista next year, but I wish you all the best in high school and I hope that you love Westwood. Well, I'm sorry we couldn't do this in person, but Luke, I wanted to let you know that you're a great student. I've enjoyed having you. Uh, you got a great head on your shoulders. You're gonna to adapt to anything that's out there and anything that comes your way. So wanted to wish you good luck and congratulations on CVH. I chose Grayson Laton as my CVMS honor student. It was an easy choice. Um, I've known from the very beginning of the year that Grayson and I were going to be um, kindred spirits. Really, he opened. He uh, one of the first things I learned about him is that he wants to open up a dog rescue farm someday. Um, and I would say that that is key to understanding his personality. He wants to do good, he wants to be good, and um, he's just 
a delight to be around. He is someone who inspires me to be a better person and just someone that I really love being around. He brightened my class. It would not have been the same without him. Um, both class period and advisory, you can just count on Grayson to be um, full of life. Thanks, Grayson. Hi, Michael. Um, I wanted to at least be able to say some things to you um, about CV Honors. Um, I know this wasn't how we intended our year to go, but I just wanted to let you know that I selected you as my CV Honors student for the spring semester of the uh, 2019 through 2020 school year because I was really proud of how hard you've worked all year in science. We only get to select two students a year, one in the fall and one in the spring. So I wanted you to know that um, I'm just really proud of all the work you've done in science. And I wish we could be there on the stage celebrating like normal, you know, announcing your name and all of that. And um, But I hope that you get my note and all of the um, certificates and coupons and stuff in the mail that you would have gotten anyway. Um, so I selected you as my CV honor student because you work hard um, and you care about your work and you care about, you know, how well you do. You are willing to redo assignments as needed. You are willing to ask questions when you need to. Um, I appreciate you being a positive presence in our, our fourth period class. Um, and I appreciate your sense of humor. You were always were very funny. I liked that we could joke back and forth with each other and that you were just a nice person. So I want you to know that I wish you all the best in high school and I hope that you continue to be a hardworking young man. Um, that is the most important thing because that's gonna get you wherever it is that you wanna go. So I miss you, Michael, and I hope that, that um, you're okay right now, but also I hope that you know that your teachers really appreciated you and really appreciate how hard you work. Hi, Shawnee, Miss O'Reilly here. So sorry we didn't get to celebrate your achievement in person. Um, I loved having you in my class this year. You're a good sport. You kept me endlessly entertained, um, as well as your classmates. Um, uh, you're just always kind to your peers, ready to work, kind of get on with it. Um, and uh, I think you're going to do just great in Westwood and beyond. Okay, just keep doing you. Bye. This is Vic. My CV honor student is Ty Thomas. Ty, I'm super proud of you. You've been a rock star this year. And I wish you all the luck at Westwood. Hello, everyone. This is Mr. Vigil here at Canyon Vista Middle School, representing the Theater Arts Department. I get the privilege of announcing three students for CV Honors. Your eighth grade students are, from Ms. Demerod, Will Hicks. Good job. Uh, from Mr. Parks, Austin Zell. And my student, Mr. Vigil's student, is Kayla Cantello. Congratulations on your CV honors. Uh, I look forward to hearing about the many great things you'll do in the future. Hey Mike, Bye. congratulations on being CV honors student. Bummer we didn't get to finish track season, but uh, looking forward to seeing you play some, uh, some ball next year. Have a great summer. Hi Alex, congrats on being um, selected by me for CVMS honors. Um, you're a great art student and you're very creative and keep up the good work. Hi, Maria. I wanted to say congratulations on being my CV honor student for eighth grade. I'm really sorry that we don't get to have school and we don't get to have the ceremony to recognize you in front of all of your peers and in front of your parents. I am just so incredibly proud of you and I miss you so much. I mean, your personality, your sense of humor, your spunkiness, just your wit, all of that just adds up to the amazing person that you are. Um, your flute playing, let's talk about that. It's amazing as well. And I feel like um, you got to play piccolo this year because you worked hard at that and you've worked hard at flute your entire career in band. Um, Maria, I'm just so proud of you. I, I can't say enough how much I'm going to miss you when you go to Westwood next year, um, but I know you're going to do great things. I, congratulations, I'm proud of you, and I miss you, and um, hopefully I get to see you soon. All right, bye. Hi, I'm Miss Phillips, eighth grade ELA teacher, and I chose Victoria Rondon Romero as my CV honor student. 
Victoria continuously impressed me this year with her insight, her wisdom, her thirst for knowledge, and the passion I see in her when she stands up for what she knows is right or when she works hard for what she wants. I'm so proud of you, Victoria, and I'm so glad I had you this year. I'm going to miss you a whole bunch next year. Have a wonderful summer. Hi, I'm Heather Neal, 8th grade U.S. History. I've chosen Jeremy Swin as my honor student for the second semester, and I just wanted to take a moment to tell you why. Uh, basically, he's an all-around amazing human being. Uh, Jeremy is very kind and caring. He's very smart and very creative, but more importantly than that, he uh, is great with other people. He offers to help. He is a very hard worker. He always gives everything 100%. And he has a great sense of humor, a very uh, subtle, quiet sense of humor. He can be shy. He sort of holds back. But once you get to know the real Jeremy, he is an honor to have as a student. Hi, I am Mary Loera, and I teach art at Canyon Vista. And my eighth grade CV honors student is Olivia Chu. Hi, Olivia. Olivia is a great student to have in my classroom. And I've had her for two years, so I've been really, really lucky. Olivia, you inspire everyone that sits around you with your beautiful artwork and your work ethic. You're very creative and I'm really proud of you. The work you've done during virtual learning has also been amazing. So kudos to you, congratulations, and I hope to see you sometime soon. Congratulations, bye. Hi, Becca, it's Miss Sweet. And I just want to say how lucky I am to have been able to choose you as my CV honor student. Um, you're such a great student. You're smart. Um, you have such a big heart. You're funny and you're just a, a joy to have in class. So I'm really going to miss you next year. Um, I know you're going to have great success at Westwood and I wish nothing but the best for you in the future. Hi, I'm Karen Downs. I teach geometry at Canyon Vista and I picked Brooke Shu for Canyon Vista Honors. I've been lucky enough to have her for two years. I had her in sixth grade and in eighth grade and I really enjoyed having her both years. She's just an awesome student and I know she's going to do amazing at Westwood next year. Hey David, this is Miss Erickson. I'm here. I just wanted to let you know that I selected you to be our Canyon Vista Mustang Honor student for the 2020 school year. You have done an excellent job being a kind friend to all of your classmates and you always work to help people when help is needed most. You work hard with your studies and completing your class assignments. I appreciate your tenacious attitude and your positive spirit, that you're always willing to try something new and take a new risk, and you do it with a positive attitude. Thanks for being amazing. Hi, I'm Coach Govea. I chose Lucy Metzger as my eighth grade CV honor student. I am so proud of you, Lucy, for all of your hard work and your positive attitude. Especially glad that you stayed injury free during this year's basketball season. Um, I know you're going to do great things in high school, and I can't wait to come see you play whatever sport it is you decide to play. Uh, keep up the hard work, and once again, I'm very proud of you, um, and I'm sure your parents are too. Hi everyone, it's Miss Chetri here. I teach reading, um, and my CV honor student was David Bradley. Um, I've been lucky enough to have him as a student since he was a seventh grader. And I'm super proud of him. I have seen so much uh, growth over those two years. Um, he's an extremely hard worker. Um, and I am definitely going to miss him when he goes to high school. So I'm um, very, very proud of him. Hi, Leighton. Uh, this is Miss Mowry here. Um, hello to your family as well if they're watching. And I am saying congratulations to you. You were chosen by me as the honor student from uh, all of my classes for the second half of the year. I don't even think you knew that. I hadn't given you the paper before spring break uh, to notify you of it. But I chose you because I feel like your growth has been phenomenal as a student and more specifically as a writer over the past year and a half. I've so enjoyed watching you come into sort of your own. Uh, I love the comic strip that you've been working on. I'm going to read the newest parts that you sent me. Thanks for sending those. And keep up the good work. You really have a gift. 
um, and I'm so pleased that I was able uh, to be privy to those gifts and that you shared them with me um, and just continue, continue to uh, work hard on those things that matter to you. Okay, take care and I hope to see you soon. Hey Caroline, I just wanted to take a minute to send you a quick video to congratulate you on being chosen as my CV honor student this semester. Uh, I chose you because uh, you've been a very uh, genuine person all year long and I really appreciate your sincerity. Um, those are a couple of qualities that I think that are going to be useful in your life. Um, I think if you just uh, you know try your best and you're honest with yourself, and honest with the people around you, um, you're gonna go very far. So uh, congratulations and a great job. Hi Zoe, Miss O'Reilly here, just congratulating you and your CV Honors Award. Um, you worked your tail off this year in my class, never complained, um, always in glass half full mode and I really appreciated that. Um, you and Ava worked really well together um, and pretty much any group I put you in, you just got it done. Um, I wish you every success in Westwood. I think you're gonna do just great. Um, just keep doing you and you will succeed. Okay, I miss you guys. Take care. Bye Hey, what's going on Sammy? Congratulations on uh, being selected as my CV honors or otherwise known as student of the month. Congratulations um, You're great. I mean, what else can I say? Uh, I, I hear the word kindness being tossed around a lot, but I think uh, if there was a person or a picture of somebody next to that word, uh, you would be high up there and being selected to be the picture next to the definition. So yeah, um, you're, uh, one of the things I also notice a lot is you kind of are really easy to get along with. And all your, every time I uh, have changed seats, you have absolutely no problem talking uh, to whoever's around you and having a good time. And I haven't seen anybody uh, or you have a negative exchange with somebody. And I, th I think that's a great thing. I got to be honest with you. So what I'm looking for, too, when I pick somebody is balance. And what I mean by balance is somebody that can, you know, enjoy themselves while they're in my class, have fun with their peers, but at the same time, get it the work done. Now, I know at this particular um, level, it's tough and you're trying to fi figure out who you are, or what do you want to do and stuff or what you want to do and stuff like that. So, um it's it's very mature um, when I say um, that you have a, a great balance. That you're a very balanced individual and you're, you have a very high level of maturity for your age. And I greatly appreciate that. It's been a pleasure uh, having you in class. Um, I'm sorry we had to have it this way, um, but it doesn't make it any less special. Uh, I chose you for a reason and that's because you're a good person and that's a big deal. So congratulations. Um, I hope you're having a, a, a safe time during this uh, coronavirus um, pandemic going on. Um, I hope you're not. I hope you're not getting too too much anxiety. I know I am. I'm always trying to stay busy and stuff, and I'm not built for staying at home. I'm a project oriented oriented type of guy, and I like to work. Um, so congratulations. I hope you're doing all right. I hope your family's doing all right. And um, cheers, Ram out. Hola, Sai, y la familia de Sai. Sai, tú eres un estudiante muy inteligente y tan simpático. Y yo estoy feliz por la oportunidad de ser tu profesora, de ser tu maestra. I miss seeing you in class and in advisory. I miss your smile. I miss your attitude, your positive attitude and your willingness to help others. And I wish all the best for you at Westwood next year. Adios. Hi, Mr. Watley here. I'm the orchestra director at Canyon Vista Middle School. My CV honor student is the incredibly talented and hardworking Hannah Lee. William Lee is my Canyon Vista honor student and I really appreciate his work with the track and field teams and uh, his leadership for the guys, especially helping the seventh graders along this year and his other eighth grade teammates. And he was a sprinter for us and I got the opportunity to work with him and he is just, just flat out wonderful to work with. And wish him the very best in all of his endeavors and uh, good luck at Westwood next year. Hi, my name is Ella. 
Rahul Shafi and uh, I'm teaching 8th grade math and algebra. My CV honor nominee is Mahavir Prakashan. Since Mahavir joined our class, he's been doing such a great job. He's been ready for the class every day. And best of all, he's been a great role model for his classmates. Mahavir, thanks for being a great student and keep up the great work. Thank you. Hi Emma, just wanted to tell you congratulations on being student of the month. I want you to know what a hard worker you've been this year and how proud I am of having you in my class. Um, you're just the hardest worker and you try hard and you do everything that I ask you to do. And I know that those skills are going to go far with you next year in high school. And I just wish that you have the best year at Westwood High School ever. Congratulations. Good morning, everybody. Um, I just wanted to, to introduce my CV honor student, Dennis. Dennis is in my U.S. History class. And one of the reasons I picked Dennis is because he's such a great student and he is great at asking questions and great looking for clarity. And he's just all around just fun to have in the classroom. He really encourages and motivates other people. Um, he always gets his work done. Um, I just really enjoy having him in class. Congratulations, Dennis. My name is Sarah Nielsen. I'm one of the coaches and the PE teachers here at Canyon Vista Middle School. My CV honor student was Freddie Descartes. Freddie came to us a little bit late this year. He uh, arrived about the middle of the first semester. And ever since he's been here, he's been a great asset to my class. He's hardworking. He never complains. He's competitive. He's respectful to his teachers and peers. I really appreciate having Freddie in my class this year. And I wish you luck in the future of wherever you go. I'm so sorry I couldn't see you uh, before you left, left us here at Canyon Vista, but I'm sure you'll do great wherever you go. Congratulations on this honor, Freddie. Hi there, my name is Austin Boriak. I am an eighth grade science teacher here at Canyon Vista Middle School. My nominee for CV honors for the spring of 2020 is Sanjitha S. And I first just want to give a very big congratulations to her for her nomination for CV honors. It is very well deserved and is very well earned. Uh, throughout the year, Sanjitha, you have exhibited many amazing qualities that I've seen in my classroom. You are an amazing student, so highly intelligent, a wonderful peer and friend to so many others. I see you go out of your way constantly to help others. I see you go out of your way to make our school a better place. You are such an intelligent big picture problem solver, and I cannot wait to see what you do, not only after your time at Canyon Vista when you go to Westwood High School, but how you change our world to be a better place. Good luck, take care, keep doing what you're doing. It is all spot on and perfect. I'm Mrs. Crane, and I am so excited to introduce my CV honor student, Kaven Stewart. Kaven is an outstanding person. He is somebody who brings laughter and joy to everybody around him, but he's also one of the most kind and caring students I've ever taught. Anytime that somebody is looking for a partner, he's there. He never questions it. He is just there to support everyone in class. Um, he also is somebody who is so creative. He is so incredibly unique, and I love all of the projects that he's done. He always puts his unique character into it. I remember when I was on leave, and I got my student roster list, and I saw that he was in my class, and I was so excited because um, He's just that person that you want in your class to, to really make sure that the whole environment is fun for everybody. So I'm really, really excited to share that Kevin Stewart is my eighth grade CV honor student. Hey, Tatiana. I'm so excited that you are my CV honor student this time. I uh, really miss that we can't celebrate in person, but I'm excited to be able to um, at least share this video in this time with you. Um, you're such a joy to teach and I really appreciated you in my first period class. Uh, you are always dependable. You had your work done and completed and done well and I appreciated that a lot. Um, thank you for all of your hard work. I've got
going to miss you next year, and I sure hope you have a great time in high school. I know that you will. Um, take care, and I love you. Bye. Hey, Damani. It's Miss Monteo. Um, I'm sending this to you because since I won't be there to say hello to you or talk to your parents um, to give you your CV Honors Award, I wanted at least send something because um, I don't want you feeling cheated out of this award um, as I really feel like you've already been cheated all these years because you haven't received it yet. Um, so to your parents, um, I just want to say that um, how this all came about was your son actually shocked me a few months ago and told me he had never received CV honors, which I cannot believe. Um, he probably deserved it way back in sixth grade. Um, but um, anyway, um, I'm just sad that you finally received this award and you're not even going to physically be at school to receive this in person. So um, I just want to say some nice things about Damani. I mean, what a uh, God, I mean, I could go all day talking how just amazing uh, Damani is. Um, he's sweet. He's caring. He's super polite. Um, one, of the, one of the more polite students I've had ever in the history of teaching. Um, you know, he's super friendly, um, not just to me, but um, every day um, before track season started, um, when I would leave, he always made it a point to say bye to not just me, but my son, who was always with me. He was my, kind of my partner in crime. Uh, he always said bye uh, to my son. And again, Damani didn't have to do that. I mean, he's an eighth grader. My son's a first grader, but Damani always made it a point to say bye to my son as well, which really made, uh, you know, my son's day. So that just shows you how kind, um, and, and sweet, uh, your son is. Um, and I wish I could tell you all this stuff in person. Um, cause I, again, I could just talk for days about just how he's just amazing. So, um, and I'm just sad that I'm not going to get to finish out the year with him. Um, I'm missing him coming every day with a smile, um, asking to use the bean bag. Um, you know, he's always thinking that he bothered me. He never did. It was kind of like a highlight of the getting of my second period was I already knew Damani was going to politely come and ask to borrow the bean bag and sit there. And he never was a problem with it. Um, again, he just, he just was so much a part of my class. Um, and I don't, I'm not having that now. So just, um, He'll definitely be one that I'll, I'll miss at the end of this year. And I cannot wait to see him do his graduation walk four years uh, from now. Um, he's going to turn out to be an amazing human being. He already is an amazing human being, but he's going to, you know, go to the Olympics. I really firmly believe that. And I can't wait. Uh, Damani, Damani, besides your parents, I'll be one of your number one fans rooting you on. I'll, if I can't be there physically to watch you run, I will – definitely be watching you on TV. Um, cause again, I think you're going to do some amazing things in the future. Um, and even if Olympics is not what you end up doing, I know that you're going to go on and do something great with your life. Um, and I feel like it's going to be something helping other people because it's just who you are. So anyway, I'll, I, I, I meant to make this short. Um, but again, I could talk for days about Damani and just what a good human he is. And I really feel right now we need more Damani's in this world. We need more caring, kind people like your son in this world. And I'm so thankful that you guys raised such a good person. So a lot of this has to do with you guys um, because nobody wakes up that good. That's a lot of uh, good parenting as well. So thank you again for putting, um, such a good person out there uh, to in sharing him with us in this world, because again, he's going to do something great and I can't wait to see what that ends up being. So, well, bye Damani and hope to see you soon. Take care, sweetie. Bye.